What's the crack lads? Welcome back to the channel. So we're just going to give a quick roundup just in case you're not at your console or you can't check. I'm just going to pop a strepsil here because my throat is still a bit sore. It's not as bad, but lads, if you get this flu that I have that's going around, trust me, it's a disaster, right? So V2.3, if you've missed out my video, check it out where we talked about, you know, like the rumors and all the stuff that was meant to come to V2.3. Um, we've got like a gameplay adjust adjustments, we've got like new cards, we've got a couple of other things going on. So I'm just going to give a quick run through of everything, as I said, in case you can't check for yourself. So we're going to start with Authentic Match. Um, as you can see here in the events, you still have that ongoing, that's staying going for the next 20 days. There's nothing else there in Authentic Match and Trial Matches as normal. Um, in Dream Team itself... We do have a couple of new events, but they're not really new. Um, the eFootball League, obviously, as well. That is going to be the phase that that is, is from the 8th of the 12th to the, to the 12th to the 1st. So that's when the other uh, event is going to be finished, or the other phase is going to be ending there, right? So you still have time to do that, so don't worry about that one. Um, but as for the events themselves, you just have the rinsed and repeated. Again, you've got the International Cup, you've got the both versions of that, you've got Worldwide Clubs, you've got the English League, which is, you know, to kind of return in the Premier League, that launched Monday, but you've got the Worldwide Clubs, which is you get your 10,000 XP, um, they're all the rewards for that. It's the same challenges, man, it's the same stuff, it's the same, you know, just different, slightly different modifications to it. You've got the Tour event that you can still play, that's just repeated as well. I was already playing that, so 100,000 uh, GP for the next result, or for the next bonus in that one. Um, that's open for another six days, and you get your three times XP. You've got the national teams against the AI, which are free international uh, player of the week. So again, that's the same as every week, so you just get your points for that, and you get your free spin. Um, then also, you know, everything else is the same here. We have touched on the gameplay stuff in the other video, so I have a full 10 minute video on that um, where they talk about the different stuff that's coming. We've got a load of gameplay additions and fixes here. We will be testing that out in a live stream as well today. Uh, dribbling, passing, traps, defense, fouls, AI, all touched up and uh, all like seemingly fixed with some of the issues cursor change issues uh general fixes all that so i've gone through all that in a lot of detail and then on to kind of the new campaign stuff so you will notice that when you sign in you will have a new um you will have a new gift here also you will get your coins uh for if you have done the video where you not the bruno cup one but if you picked one if you'd picked the team or played with whatever team that you had picked for the international cup um the rankings you'd get in your coins for that so i think i picked did i pick spain i think or portugal i'm not too sure who i picked um you'll also have your chance deal it's a gift uh, for the login bonus so it's great captains this week um you also have this login bonus as well uh, for today. And then you also have whatever rewards you have. So we can receive all of those. Um, and then onto the actual contracts themselves. So there's a couple of new players here. Obviously, we don't have that. Obviously, like we don't have packs because the watch call it is gone. Um, the, National, the World Cup is over. But we do have this. We've got these worldwide clubs, legendary ones. Uh, we've got two, the second one of them now. So if you haven't opened that already... You can open that now for, for two of them. So I've got two lined up there. So when I open these, I'll be able to get, you know, you're going to get all these players anyway because there's four login bonuses. Um, but they also give you a, a Germany great captain's free spin as well. And in those, you have Beckenbauer, Rummenegi, and Matthaus. I mean, that's probably, I'd say that's probably the best trio of, you know, uh, players that they've released. I would, I would love to get any of the three of those. I might actually spin for these lads. I'm actually going to spin one now straight off the bat while we're talking. But yeah, it is just kind of a, a, a rinse and repeat. I think I, I, I would have liked to have like a Christmas campaign or a, a season's kind of campaign, maybe like a, an online cup or something. We are, we're not going to get a legend anyway. Look who we get. Oh, absolute beast. I prefer him to Beckenbar lads. Don't worry. Um, but we have the International Cup. I'm going to be doing reviews on all of these. So this is the last World Cup selection for Player of the Week. So I will be doing reviews on them. You can see they've kind of got special shiny players. Um, and it is a mixture of Argentina. You've got Modric. You've got Dari. 
and uh, Zayek, and then the rest are Argentina and France. So, yeah, fairly, I mean, we get another, this the 15th version of Mbappe. I mean, everyone should probably have Mbappe, Hernandez by now, Modric, De Maria. There's some good players here, in fairness, Modric looks absolutely insane uh, as, a, as a passer and stuff, but uh, we will do the review for them in just a couple of minutes and have it up on the channel as usual. And then you also have, uh, who else do we have? We had that yesterday. I thought there was one more thing that I had to look at. Am I tripping? Am I tripping, lads? No, I think that's it. I think that's it for the, the contents and, and, and stuff like that. Um, and then obviously that's festive season campaign. That is still ongoing. So those four legendary special login bonuses, you will have got two of those today. Um, you'll have one from last week and you'll have one today, which is two. And then if you keep playing the campaigns, the challenge events and the tour events, it pretty much if you complete everything in the festive campaign, you're going to get four legend players, 200 coins, 160,000 trainer points and 1.4 million GP. So it's a lot. It's a lot, man. I mean, they're gearing you up for um, for next year, really. That's kind of what it is. So uh, there's nothing added to the match pass. Obviously, that match pass came on Monday. And that's been there since the 15th, uh, or it came last Thursday, sorry, it's been there since the 15th. And the, the, what you call it, the objectives then as well are just going to carry over and carry on from where you've already been playing. So if you, you know, this will reset, so the eFootball League goals in the phase, um, that will reset as it does every week. And then you can complete all of these as well. So that's pretty much it, lads. As I said, I've given a lot of my thoughts on it already. We've had a load of videos out um, and we will complete continue to put out more videos. You can still do all the international cups and all that to get your coins. I've literally just been playing. Look, man, look how much coins I have, right? And I haven't bought coins like in ages. I have literally just got my like 50. I've done the I've done every challenge event for coins um and cleared every match pass for coins and done everything that i can to get coins um as much as possible like you know you don't even need to buy coins anymore now in my opinion so yeah that is it for me i will be back quite soon lads i hope you're enjoying the content and uh, let me know your thoughts on the game i will have all the player reviews up quite soon peace